Shalom to everyone who is watching and listening to me right about now. Brothers and sisters, I have a powerful word just for you. Remember that you are not watching this message by mistake. You have not clicked on this video by coincidence. There is a reason as to why this video has been recommended to you right about now. Brothers and sisters, I want to tell you that you are blessed. You are not cursed. The Bible says that he who God has blessed, no one can curse. Actually, there is no witchcraft against Israel. There is no witchcraft against you. They will try to do all sorts of evil schemes, but they will not work out on you because you are blessed. You are a child of God. Brothers and sisters, today's scripture is from the book of Psalms, chapter 1, verse 1 to 3. It reads, Blessed is the man who walks not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor stands in the path of sinners, nor sits in the seat of the scornful, but his delight is in the law of the Lord, and in his law he meditates day and night. He shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that brings forth its fruit in its season, and whose leaf also shall not wither, and whatever he does shall prosper. Have you heard that last part? Whatever he does, he shall prosper. Whatever you do, you shall prosper. The Bible calls you blessed. If you walk not in the counsel of the ungodly, you are blessed. If you do not stand in the path of sinners, you are blessed. If you do not sit in the seat of the scornful, you are blessed. If you delight in the law of the Lord and meditate on that law, on that word, day and night, the Bible calls you blessed. So if you have been doing these things, you are blessed. Consider yourself blessed. These are the promises of God. You shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that brings forth its fruit in its season. This is the word of God. You see, it's very important that you read the word of God. That you don't abase your knowledge on people's opinions. That you don't base your understanding on what people's understanding. Because Man's understanding is unlimited. Is limited, sorry. Man's understanding is limited, but the understanding of God, it's unsearchable. So you let your focus be on Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Brothers and sisters, I hope this word has blessed you because you are blessed already. Until next time, shalom.